Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm gonna to be doing a home decor haul. Do you guys know how much I love shopping for home decor? I've been on this black and white trend and I found some really fun things at Home Goods that I wanna share with you guys. And also I have a few items that are kind of collective. Also wanted to let you guys know that Lifestyle Sundays are still on. The reason I didn't upload a video this past Sunday is because my husband and I took a mini birthday getaway trip. Um, I am officially in my last year in my 20s, which is just crazy like where does time go i have no idea moving right on i'm just gonna go ahead and jump into the haul so i'm gonna start off with um one of my favorite purchases that i made over the past couple of months and this was actually picked up on my husband i love them so he knows me so well he knows that i love um long stem wine glasses and he knows that i like the top part to be nice and round and full <laughs> because I do like red wine. These are the most perfect wine glasses I have ever come across, ever. They're so perfect and they are from Z Gallery. I love that they're sold individually because I actually just broke one yesterday. So now I can just go and replace it singly. I hate it whenever I buy those sets and one breaks and you basically have to buy an entire other set or you just have to deal with having an uneven number of wine glasses. It really shouldn't be that big a deal, but it drives me nuts. The next thing I picked up that you may have seen on Snapchat as well is this jar. We actually bought this to replace Nala's little um, snack bit. <laughs> I feel so bad because every time I see the word snacks, her, her little ears perk up. This is why she's on my lap right now because I brought this in from the kitchen and she knows that all her little doggy snacks are in here. So this is from Neiman Marcus. This is from the brand McKinsey Childs and it does have a little rubber grip so it does keep her treats nice and air air airtight. Oh my gosh, I can't talk today. It's just a gorgeous pattern. It matches my tea kettle that I got a few months ago. I brought it out here just to show you in case you haven't seen it. I did talk about it in a video and you've probably seen it in like my morning routine videos. This is also by McKinsey Childs and it's a really good teapot. I was reading the reviews on this. A lot of people are saying that the little knob comes off, but I think I figured out why people are having so much trouble. When you put the lid down, you can actually turn it and it locks the lid. See how it doesn't come up easily? And I think what people are doing is that they're locking it and then trying to jam it out. You basically have to slightly turn it again. It'll release really easily. If you have this teapot and you're having that problem, hopefully that solves it for you. So now this next thing that I found at Home Goods is gonna make a lot more sense why I got it. It's this beautiful two-tiered stand and it's by the brand Cynthia Rowley. I've bought several things uh, that she makes and this one was only $13. This is definitely a good value, but you can see it still matches the black and white theme, which I absolutely love. And they also had a little teapot, a ceramic teapot with the same pattern. And you can see it has a gold detailing at the top, the black and white, and the gold rim. This was actually a birthday gift from my friend Michelle from Ready, Set, Glamour. I haven't even taken it out of the box, but I am so excited for it because it's like a tapas um, size fondue set. And I'm actually gonna open it for the first time on camera because I have yet to open this. But my husband and I love fondue, especially cheese fondue. And I know you guys have seen my little hibachi set that I like to roast marshmallows on. So this is really like definitely right up my alley. It even comes with the little skewers and here's the little fondue set. Michelle, if you're watching, thanks girl. I'm definitely gonna get a lot of use out of this. The next thing I picked up, I told you guys I'm on this black and white kick, are these um, furry black pillows. And this is just so soft and it just makes you think of winter time, this uh, texture, and it is so luxurious looking. I feel like Z Gallery would have had something like this for so much more expensive and $20 at home goods. That, I think that's pretty good. Got two of them, and these are gonna go in my living room because I'm doing a black and white theme. I even got a new rug, and you guys, I am so excited because I'll leave a link down below to the rug that I end up getting. I think it's gonna tie the whole living room together and it's gonna give it like a fresh new look. I'm really excited. Of course, you guys know I will show you once I'm all done with everything, but that's why I got this pillow. Also, I picked up these two little um, benches. So I showed you guys how I put this mirror with the ghost table. I ended up putting the stools underneath that ghost table. I think it just ties in that black and white, 
from the living room into the dining area and the kitchen. That's all that that little area was missing was something soft because I feel like it felt a little too cold and shiny, like it needed something to warm it up. And those stools were so perfect. I forgot to mention these candles, which I showed in one of my recent videos and I got a ton of questions about. These are actually available at Costco right now. You can get a whole set. I believe it's like 12 in one set. But I also found them on Amazon in case you don't have a Costco membership or you don't have a Costco near you. I will leave the Amazon link down below. It comes with a remote control and it just sets a different type of ambiance, you know, if you don't want to have the lights on, but you also don't want to have a billion candles on. They also have a timer set. So let's say you turn them on at night and you want to make sure that the, you don't exhaust the battery. You can set it to a five hour timer or I believe 10 hours. Oh, and by the way, Mr. Penguin is back at HomeGoods. I hauled him last year, and I know a ton of you wanted to find him and you couldn't because he was sold out, but he is back. I have verified, so if you go to your nearest HomeGoods, you will probably find this little guy because all the Christmas stuff is out. I love him so much. I can't say it too loud because Nala gets jealous. So I just have a couple more things to show you, and these are all for Nala. I really wanted to share it with you because every year I go, they always have little doggy clothes during the winter time but I always go too late and Nala sizes are always sold out so I wanted to share with those of you that also have small dogs so I got this little sweater during the winter time we have tile all over our house and I feel like it gets really really cold I always find her like curled up in a little ball somewhere so these sweaters really keep her warm and the next sweater oh my gosh this one is so cute you guys it has little snowflakes it's pink and white with snowflakes and then it has a little hoodie with a little um poof ball on it and then the one that she's wearing let me pick her up so you can see it i also got her this one i think this one was only seven dollars these are all size small you don't want to be on camera no you being grumpy today i just realized this haul is really really short i hope you guys don't mind i have a huge makeup haul coming up with like makeup gift sets if you follow me on Snapchat, you saw my Sephora cart. So I am ready for that. I also have a really fun video coming up this Sunday. So I'm excited for that. All right, guys, that is everything I have for this video. I really hope you guys liked it, even though it seems kind of short. But sometimes short and sweet is the way to go, right? Especially if you're five, two and a half. So I'll talk to you guys on my next video. Mwah. Bye. So I thought it'd be a lot of fun to do just like my favorite fragrances.